All right, y'all, I just got in from picking my tomatoes. <clears throat> We've got a white tomasol here. Um, we've got a 576 gram gold medal. <laughs> and we've got a 776 gram <laughs> Abraham Lincoln. This thing was a beast. We'll get into that in a future video. But for this one, we're gonna go ahead and slice into this white tomasol here. I've heard uh, these have a pretty nice tomato-y flavor and that they're, uh, they're good, but they're pretty mild, so we're gonna find out. Um, this one's pretty soft. It's got a kind of like a golden yellow on the shoulder here like a tiny bit of green that's slowly fading away and um it's wet just because i rinsed it off but i was like i didn't know how long to let it go because it's like getting whiter and whiter on the bottom as it goes but it's it's really soft so it feels like it's time so we're gonna give it a slice uh this way first <clears throat> Actually, let's go like this, so you guys can see. Okay, it's going to do a really thin slice. Boop. Move like that. Definitely nice and juicy. Pretty meaty. I thought it was just going to be one of those standard, like, kind of three uh, segment seed pod things. But uh, let's give this a little shot here. It's definitely white. That's cool. All right. Time. Hmm. Interesting. It's definitely uh, tomato-y. Um, not like insanely so. It's pretty mild, but it's definitely got like a zip to it, like. Still has a bit of an acid bite. Yeah. Definitely. On the. Milder end. For sure. But in general. It's pretty good. Let's slice into this gold metal. What the hell. One sec. Move this up a bit. Okay. There we go. A little bit more. All right. Don't slice your hand off. It's probably going to be pretty yellow inside, from my experience. See this piece? Cool, like red bubbles. All right, one more slice here. Hmm. 
I'm gonna give it a thicky because I'm gonna have a snacky. Oh wow, right up into the the core there. It's kind of cool. And yeah, there was some cat facing on the side here, so I can cut that little piece out. But let's see. Yeah, check that out. That looks cool. Let's give this a try. Gold medal. Here we go. Whoa. That's insanely sugary compared to the white tomasol. That is not even a comparison. <laughs> this is so much better. Not anything against white tomasol, but dude. Wow. That tastes crazy. Look at the color on there. That pink. Wow. That gold medal is incredible. Wow. Okay, well, that's this tomato test video. Um, are there any other ones I could try? Mm, let me see, hold on. All right, let's give this guy a shot. A very ripe black cherry. Slice down the center. Here's what we're looking at. There's the other side. Slice across the grain. It seems like it's a two cavity cherry tomato. Let's give this uh, slice here a try. Looks pretty good. Hmm. Wow. Is that that sugary or is that just picking up juice from the gold metal down there? <laughs> I think mean, it's sugary, but it's not that sugary. Let me just try the gold medal again for comparison. Yeah, that's a lot more sugary, but. Wow. Yeah, gold medal for the win, y'all. It's really yummy. As far as the uh, the orange tomatoes that I've tried, I've had Chef's Choice Orange. Um, we've had gold medal, white tomasol, I guess. You could kind of stick it in this category. I had Dr. Y Cheese Yellow. That was good, too. But, uh, yeah. Really cool uh, to have these yummy tomatoes at my disposal because I'm going to be eating them. Man, that's crazy. It almost tastes like... It's hard to explain how sweet this gold medal is. It doesn't even taste like a tomato. It almost tastes like a cantaloupe. Yeah, let's see. I'm gonna give it a cut. 
down the center so we can see that cool coloration. It's pretty cool. A lot of meat there. Let's see. The joys of uh, having your own tomato harvest is you can eat it however the hell you want to. And I'm going to do this because it's going to be friggin' amazing. Here we go. Yep. Sure is. Alright, y'all. Peace out. Have a good day.